do subscribe to ekeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos hello students today we are studying chapter organisms and environment in that we are studying topic ecological succession when i say succession it means moving from one generation to another for example from your parents to your father till you today we'll study how succession works in nature ecological succession when i say succession it means how from generation to generation people change the succession in your family is your grandparents your parents and then you and then your children this is called as succession in normal terms we call it generation to generation but in bio it is called as succession moving from one period to another period now there is a term in bio which is called as ecological succession ecological succession means the gradual and predictable change that takes place in particular species from position to position at different environments the composition of particular species that change at a particular area in particular year of time for example when earth started there were dinosaurs along with that there were trees but slowly steadily due to ecological changes the dinosaurs disappeared and the composition of trees also changed for example your parents would be saying that uh, 10 years down the line there were a lot of mangroves in the coastal area of konkan but now mangroves are not there pollution cutting down of trees deforestation are the reasons ecological succession means how species of plants and animals in a particular area change over the due course of time now ecological succession can be divided into two types that is primary succession and secondary succession when i say primary succession primary succession means the succession of organisms or the ecology of organisms start in a area where organisms neither plants never existed for example if there is a barren land or a desert and you start cultivating a crop at that barren land or desert that crop will be the first crop to be cultivated on that barren land this phenomena is called as primary succession it means initially there were no trees or plants or animals but you started it for the first time that is primary succession when earth started trees mountains animals came in that is called as primary succession of earth next one is secondary succession when i say secondary succession remember hiroshima and nagasaki the place where nuclear bombs were dropped out till today there are cases of chromosomal defects are hiroshima and nagasaki but few years down the line hiroshima and nagasaki got back its original form it got back its trees human population environment animals species everything that is something which is called as secondary succession secondary succession is nothing but gaining back or getting back trees animals different species at a particular place where it has been destroyed initially an example of secondary succession could also be once you do deforestation or you cut down trees then after few years down the line or few months down the line when you plant another set of trees that is called as secondary succession secondary succession is nothing but doing it second time at that same place while as primary succession is the first time you do it whenever you do secondary succession the biomass at that particular place or the total living matter at that particular place increases
the definition of ecological succession is it is a gradual it means a slow change it will take time of its own and fairly predictable change for example if there are trees which are coming slowly on a desertic ground you can predict that after few months there will be a lot of trees on that desertic ground so ecological succession is a gradual and fairly predictable change in the species composition of a given area when i say species it could be plants animals birds apes anything ecological succession can be of two types primary the initial one or secondary primary succession is nothing but start in a area where organisms never existed it could be a desertic area it could be area when earth formed initially the first time trees came on earth the second type of succession is secondary succession in this type of succession organisms species or plants are formed where initially there was nothing that existed for example hiroshima nagasaki or whenever a nuclear bomb or bomb blasting or fights happen or after deforestation the second time during ecological succession the striking feature that happens is that the total organic matter when i say total organic matter it means the total amount of carbon hydrogen oxygen nitrogen that are present inside plants animals species changes for example if there are no trees present on a land obviously the amount of organic matter would be very less in comparison to when there are a lot of trees present on a particular ground the amount of organic matter would be very large students in this part of the chapter we have studied the two types of ecological succession primary succession which is done initially and secondary succession which is done later on once the biodiversity or the trees species animals are lost i hope you all are clear with the concept of ecological succession thank you